Hello YouTube, this is Keith Kevin Ken. How you doing? How you doing? I hope you're doing well. It's time again for another knife of the day. This is a brand new Spydeco. It's right out of the factory of Spydeco. It is a Sprint Run Delica 4. Remember about a year ago, they introduced the Warrencliffe Delica 4. Well, guess what? They've just added to their Burnt Orange collection, their Hap 40 Burnt Orange collection. This is the Sprint Run for this year. It is a Delica 4 Warrencliffe blade and Hap 40 steel. And I'll tell you, that Warrencliffe is a nice one. I like just the regular Warrencliffe. And now we're, in, we're adding to the HAP40. I love the HAP40 Sprint Run series. And I love how they broke out first with the, you know, the Endora, the Delica, the Stretch, the Dragonfly, the Man Bug, and the Ladybug just like they're breaking out uh, some of the new steels now. And then over time, and those are sprint runs, and over time they've been adding to it. Here's another sprint run that adds to it, and it's the Warrencliffe blade. Have you tried the Warrencliffe yet with uh, the Delica? It's really nice. I'm surprised they haven't done a Warrencliffe Endora yet. <laughs> You know, or just start doing a lot of Warren Cliff blades. But I love this as a sprint run. I am really excited about the Burnt Orange collection. And I'm happy to have all of those knives. I really am. So let's talk about it. The blade, again, Warren Cliff, full flat ground blade. It's a great slicer. Wonderful EDC with the Warren Cliff blade. 2.9 inches, that's the blade. Whenever I talk about 2.9 inches, I'm talking about from the tip to the tip of the handle. The edge, the cutting edge is 2.5 inches. Pretty much the same as a regular Delica flat ground blade. 7.1 inches, that's the total. And only 2.4 ounces. And of course it has that strong back lock. I really like it. I know a lot of people don't like back locks. <laughs> Period. Because it messes up with their smooth taking down the blade. <laughs> I get it. I'm an old guy <laughs> with a little bit of arthritis when the weather's bad. So I don't... I don't mind hitting it and putting my finger in and taking it down. Um, but I understand. I understand. Um, you pay your money, you should get what you want, right? Or wait for it to come. Um, as I told you, I think yesterday, uh, Spyderco has announced that they're sending out, they sent us a letter in the Collector's Club um, that five more knives are coming our way. I hope I get them by the end of the well, by the beginning of next week, probably. Um, four are just one, four variations on one blade. And the next one is a variation, but a very special variation on a blade. So that I'm really happy to have. So let's go back to this FRN scales. I just like FRN scales. I call it Space Age Plastic. It's so durable. So durable. Uh, as you guys know, I'm not a hard-used knife guy. Um, <laughs> I love collecting. You know, in collecting, it's already just a group of the whole, right? There's a lot of people, and a lot of people like a lot of stuff. Then you get this collector's group. You know, all of us, we like knives. We like to look at knives. I have like a hundred knife channels on YouTube that I subscribe to, and we like to own them. I'm also a collector in coins and first, you know, a lot of stuff. And then you get this small group, and for some reason, 
God bless them. But for some reason, people then want to build a hierarchy. You already are a small knife loving group. Then you've got the, I only hard use my knives. I'm happy you hard use your knives. You paid for it. Hard use it. Um, you know, some people are collectors. I'm a collector. I say that all the time. Um, but man, oh man, some of the things I read on Instagram and watch on YouTube, it's like, hey, listen, it would be such a better world if we all realize you do you. <laughs> I And I, I, I mean this. I don't mean to be goody to. I'm happy you do you. As long as it doesn't interfere with me doing me. Beautiful. Um, so it's great because I get accused of, oh, you just like pocket jewelry. You like, it's me. I like what I like. Um, but I have to tell you, I love seeing hard used knives because my work doesn't afford me that. And I love it. I've seen some of my knives via YouTube really beat up. And I love to see that. And in regular use, not someone who, you know, bought a knife to tear apart. And I have seen people with FRN scales, and a friend of mine has uh, a Delica or an Endura in their shop. And I'll tell you, it looks more beautiful beat up. And you see just how tough FRN is. Again, fiberglass reinforced nylon. It's just really tough and wonderful. So if you're looking for a hard use knife, this is it. Now remember HAP40 and Spyderco is doing a lot of super steels uh, that aren't stainless. HAP40 is not stainless. You have to take care of it, okay? It will rust on you. And that's why they sandwich it in between SUS410 for this blade. And that makes it harder and also, you can see the line right there. Below the line is HAP40. Above it is SUS on both sides. And so that bottom can rust on you. You got to take care of it. The SUS is stainless. It also adds some strength to an already strong knife material. Of course, the clip four-way, like on all Delica 4s, right hand, left hand, tip up tip down it comes with the tip up I talk about the fact that I'm in the collectors club that's why you see the 23 so let me talk about those numbers I am number 23 a lot of knives in my collection before I became collectors I knew some collectors and I bought a lot of their knives because I knew they were well done and and they got them early and stuff so you know you'll see 18 and a lot of other knives but 23 is mine haven't been a full year yet people ask me how do you become a part of spyderco collectors club i i, I want to i'll say this and i don't mean it you should google it because there's a lot of involvement but you have to commit to buying all the knives so it's a very expensive thing and we are just like you guys waiting for spydercos you don't know when they'll drop or what they'll drop Okay, so <laughs> I've had them drop a bunch of knives. They caught, and you get a discount because you're buying all of them, but not heavy, heavy, heavy discount. Not heavy, heavy, heavy discount. I've had them drop knives, and it was four hundred dollars, and then two weeks later, drop a seven hundred dollar bunch of knives. So uh, that's the collector's club, but it's wonderful to have the knives in hand. It really is. So anyway, I'm sorry I went off. I, I just enjoy talking to you guys. And it's a tough work week for me for some reason. I don't know why. Um, so when I do, I babble with you guys way too much. Let's get back to why we're here, right? This is a sprint run. The sprint runs are starting to come out, which I love. The knives from the catalog. And now since Blade 2018 has ended, we'll start getting some of those mid uh, year catalog knives as well and usually it's a mix we'll get some mid-year catalog knives before we even get the regular year catalog and even some of last year's catalog knives i'm excited this is an exciting uh, time stick around we'll do the knife of the day and you'll get to see some spider as soon as they come out 
that's a native just want to give you the size and that is a manix too so you get a size of the delica knife of the day the delica four with worn cliff blade it's a sprint run sprint runs from spydeco mean about 1200 give or take 200 or so knives once they're sold out they are gone and they're on the secondary market a lot more expensive <laughs> i invested really wanted to go with this whole burnt orange series and i'm glad i did um and that's it tomorrow i'm not going to get the spiticos in the mail tomorrow so tomorrow i'm going to have a knife from a company that I've never used before. And then I realized I did use them once because I own one knife from them. Um, so we'll, we'll talk about that knife tomorrow. Hey, check out the videos, the sale videos, a lot of knives there. Um, you guys take good care of yourselves. I hope you're having a wonderful summer so far. So far, so good. Take good care of yourselves. Keep those pockets full. Goodbye.